Good afternoon. I'm uh, Roger Blumenthal, uh, Professor of Medicine at Johns Hopkins. I'm here with a good friend and colleague, Dr. Alan Taylor, who is pleased, Alan, to have you here and to give a presentation about cardiac CT, current clinical indications, and encourage the audience to please email in your questions for Dr. Taylor and myself. And is these detector arrays that are one of the first technical advances over the last five years. Uh, it started in the era of single slice, then four slice, eight slice, 16 slice, and the community standard now is 64 slices or rows. What is a row? Well, it's, a, it's the number of detectors or channels on which cardiac CT attenuation data is gathered. Each one's about six tenths of a millimeter in thickness. And so when you stack those 64 rows of 0.6 millimeter uh, detectors on top of one another, you get a total coverage in terms of the portion of the chest that's covered in one sector of the scan of about four centimeters. And it's there's been this rapid progress in the coverage provided by the detector arrays, which has led to faster scans, wider coverage scans, fewer artifacts, and lower in helping us lower radiation dose.